So Ygreen is a PACE financing company. What that means is we take the equity in a home or a business building, commercial building, and we give people money for specific things. For us, it was, um, we have a lot of data that we process, uh, specifically underwriting data. We have tons of different um, points that we have to validate about the property, about the company, or about the person. And so for us, we have lots of data sources that are being aggregated, and we also have lots of systems that need to churn on that data. So it came down to some scalability issues for us where we were running everything on massive servers that we just reached the limit of being able to scale them vertically. So using Kubernetes, we were able to you know, scale out vertically um, and distribute those workloads just like, uh, just like anybody else. We're actually running Kubernetes clusters at the tenth of a cost because we're using AWS EC2 Spot, which the Kubernetes um, COPS uh, project has allowed us to do. And um, we're also able to deploy a lot more frequently. So we were, um, we were deploying every week to two weeks, and now we're deploying in the middle of the week during the daytime and things like that. And we're also doing it without any downtime. CNCF has been an amazing incubator for so many other projects. And, and now we, we look at CNCF, the, the web page regularly to find out if there's any new, awesome, high quality projects that we can implement into our, our stack. It's actually become a, a hub for us of knowing what software we need to be looking at to make our systems more secure or more scalable. At Ygreen, Kubernetes has changed the game as far as scalability and observability and security. We couldn't do the things that we're doing now. Uh, we're adding new data sources that are very secure data. And without the security abstractions that Kubernetes is giving us, separating pods, and without the observability that FluentD and other um, CNCF projects are giving us, we couldn't do these things in a way that we could tell our investors and our uh, team members that we know what's going on. In the future, we'd love to implement a lot more of the CNCF projects. We consider all of them to be very high quality. Um, the hot ones that I'm looking at are Spiffy and Spire, as well as the Istio service mesh. We have a lot of microservices and a lot more planned, and we want to be able to abstract the authentication between those and the identity management between those so that we don't spin our wheels uh, on creating authentication profiles and things like that for something that's already been solved.